The Aurangi Restoration Trust has a vision of what the forest might be in 50 years' time. The predator controls at the moment in the Aurangi is, starts with 1080, but surrounding the area that we have 1080 being dropped, uh, we are establishing a, a trapping program. We have 25 different groups and individuals trapping around the park. An essential part of the, the long-term program that we have is to understand what is happening in the forest. We want to know what the impacts of the predators are. We want to understand the impacts of our pest control. Leading that is Victoria University of Wellington. So Victoria University works with the Hirangi Restoration Trust and TB Free New Zealand. We measure a number of aspects of biodiversity. There's been claims that after 1080 drop the forest goes silent, but what we found was that within a few weeks afterwards there was certainly no decline in birdsong levels, and one to two years later in fact the amount of birdsong had increased substantially, particularly for bellbirds, tomtits and riflemen. In the long term, predator-free New Zealand is very much in our sights. I really want to save as much as we can, as quick as we can.